Hey guys, uh, we're finally here in Virginia. I didn't film too much on the way here, but we are on our way to the convention center. Uh, it's about to start. Uh, we're we're going to meet Ben. Uh, Jordan is here. He's commanding the camera. And uh, we got uh, Jameson here. We sure do. <laughs> Amen. And uh, yeah, uh, I've got all my mocks ready away. This is mine, as you can see. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we're gonna go. See you at Brick Fair. There it is. There's Brick Fair. Like, I can't wait to meet Mr. Kevin Hinkle. Oh, like, it's Mr. Kevin Hinkle. <laughs> Kevin Hinkle is super impressed by my Shaggy impression, so the minute I see him, I'm gonna be like, yo, is that Mr. Kevin Hinkle? Like, it's Mr. Kevin Hinkle. Like, George. I'm Are you guys ready for Brick Fair? I'm ready for Mr. Oh, cars. <laughs> and uh, David, or uh, this girl over here. Good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See you look nice. Hey, Ben. Hey. Hey, guys. Hey, Pohatu. Hey. Didn't see you there. I mean, I was looking right at you. So. This is us. We're here at Brick Fair. Jordan's behind the camera. Say Zoom, Jordan. festivities. All that's getting cut out. because it's not in focus. Jordan! Where are you taking me, bro? Fish game? Yeah. George! I want to go to fish game! Yeah, we're going to fish game. Yeah, let's go to fish game. Great. <laughs> Only the Tower of Babel, and he is no stranger to transfiguration, seamlessly changing his head into that of a horse, or his soul into something called bean corn. The scientists still have not deciphered. Please welcome onto the stage Thomas Sumiki! Woo! There you go, that's our first team tonight. From the days of wearing a mask, which allowed audiences to see themselves reflected in it, to partaking in two massively successful talk shows, and now working on an original screenplay already rumored for an Academy. <laughs> it's a little known fact that the Matrix is loosely based on his life. It's LJ! Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And now my final and fourth guest for the night was the fifth Beatle to the Bionicle team in that he was a personal consultant to the design team who was personally suggested by Christian Faber himself to join the company. <laughs> Every night when mocks are put on display at any conferences, he flies by and he perfects those that can use some help. But much like Kendrick Lamar, he always likes to stay humble. Let's welcome Ben Adriana Steen. <laughs> <laughs> so we got. Is there a specific reason why? Is there a specific reason why? Yeah. 
your context there. He misheard what he said. He misheard what he said. Oh my god, I got it. So it's Team Adriana Steen. Adriana is a team. <laughs> so we got Team Adriana Steen. Adriana is a team. Cool. So I just want to make sure that you know during this game, everyone follows the BZ Power rules. Of course. Right? This is going to be family friendly. Oh, no, I'm not going to uh, No politics, no religion, no romance because that's not canon. <laughs> um, no double posting. Right. Um, you know, only post one chapter of your epic per day. Oh, dang it. Uh, but it's so good. <laughs> so, so those are the rules. Um, so now that you know the rules, Papa, what's your team name? So I was thinking that um, since all you out here make me feel like an old man, <laughs> and we've got Sumiki here who's team farm animals. Of course. Oh, sorry, sorry, Rocket. <laughs> um, we are team horse farm upstate. Oh. <laughs> you know the. We'll see this later. They're they're actually the glue that's holding uh, the soles of my shoe. <laughs> Like, so the lovely team right here is going to tell us how to defeat Terranax, and they're going to do it by basically a game of hot potato with their words, one by one, and then when I ring the bell, you all get to say one word that they have to incorporate. Alright, 60 seconds on the uh, clock, let's start with Sumiki. Sumiki, tell us how to defeat Terranax, 60 seconds on the clock, starting now. When. You. Try. What? No, you gotta wait for the... <laughs> Disqualified! What is five points? I got nervous. <laughs> When you want to defeat the evilest, horriblest Lakuda ever, you must try <laughs> to collect all of the masks and use all of them to <laughs> Defeat Makuta and all the Shadow Toa. And if you hesitate, <laughs> you will die. Horribly. Trying to win, not help them. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for that. It's so much easier. <laughs> Okay, you can't, uh, you can't, not, you can't do it. I don't believe in you. Are we enjoying this? Song? You got the basic shape if it was wrong. Looks like the <laughs> <laughs> Next one, Monty the right. Island. Monty to the Island, LJ. Do you, you think we'll get all six regions? Imagine an island that looks like Monty Like the robot That's, face? If it was a potato, I guess it's <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you did try to get the, the mountains in there. Greg has a plastic surgery since he last saw him. It looks like you gave up on the picture already. And a Prana! Prana, LJ, you can't mess Which one? You look Is it the Za or the Za? <laughs> uh, oh shoot. The, the Krana... The Krana, yes, all the above. It's all the above. <laughs> it's yes, all, oh, wow. Oh, that's fine. You decide, you decide, you decide. Oh, if you have to do that, then there's at least some points on Alright, yes. three points out for the show. Show the audience it's exactly what it is. The island of Mononui. Five points for the island of Mononui. We're on eight points. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Greg Firsty's face. You work with them, Rick. You know who works with them. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry. Share with the class. Share with the class. <laughs> So, That's Greg Farsi's face, what do we think? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that one I'm excited to be real to see. It's an ingrown somewhere. But it's kind of It's his. Zero points in a lifetime of sorrow for LJ. And a chrono! 
George, what are we doing? <laughs> like, we're gonna go find Mr. Kevin Hink. We're Hinkle hunting. We're going for the Hink. And we're gonna give him a Let's, Let's find, find Mr. Kevin Hinkle. We just saw him. He's backstage at the Sean Kenny presentation. Big applause. Hold up, hold up. There he is. He's right there. Like, is he you ready? busy? You ready for this? Like Scoob! Like it's Mr. Kevin Hinkle! Like Mr. Hinkle! Like I don't understand, man! Oh my god, I don't What is he doing? Can I give him a handshake, man? Give him a handshake. I can't handle both the dual shag. I can't handle dual shag. It's double shag. It's double shag. It's double shag. I got knife yesterday. Like I totally saw it. Show me. It's in my hotel room. Nice. Sorry. I mean knife. It means it's because I treasure it more, so I wanted to keep it. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, thank you for that. That was. Perfect. We were trying to hunt you down get, like the last the two days. <laughs> oh, I'm. Sorry. Uh, yeah, it gets. I get increasingly less available. Yeah, can you stop being busy? Yeah. Okay. Stop. Thanks. Stop doing whatever the heck this is, and uh, just just sit here and listen to Shaggy impressions. Yes. <laughs> I heard that uh, you, you guys weren't digging the road trip to Brick Fair, North Carolina. Heck no. No. <laughs> <laughs> didn't want to fly. Didn't want to fly again. Yeah, I, I see the batteries low. Here's the beauty of editing. Yes, I could have swore you guys had the time of your life. On that road trip. Like, I swear. I was like, wow, they had a, a lot of fun on that road trip. And we had, lo and behold, we're like, no, we don't think we hate that. No, it's like, wow, okay. But I hated it. I don't that, know what kind that road trip was compressed down into about you. ten minutes. You also agreed. You yes, I did. It was cool. <laughs> Here we have David Pagano and Sean Penny doing a presentation. And right over here we got Jordan Snead. And then in the background we've got TTV and crew just hanging out. Creator of mock pages, the little guys. All in one spot. I was wondering to be something else. So that's. Hi guys!
What is this guy doing? It even has an axle on the inside. Yeah, it is. Alex, do you want to be in the vlog? Oh no. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, can I introduce the United Hapori? All right. Say hi to the vlog, everyone. Hi to the vlog, everyone. Hi to the vlog. All right. Say hi, everyone. All right. Mr. Man with no face, what, who are you? Uh, I'm Shadow the Dark Lord on YouTube and Shadow the Dark Lord on Instagram. Very nice, very nice. Alrighty, Dark Black Raven. <laughs> Black Raven. Dark Raven fam. Dark Get Raven. Right. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I got, I'm mostly active on Instagram, but I guess I got Pardon the YouTube. We got this in post. But anyway, <laughs> you, uh, got a YouTube Dark Raven Films and Instagram Dark Raven Films. That's all pretty all much right. back to that. Awesome, thank you. Yes. I'm Matt. I'm Batsy Knockoff on Instagram. Batsy Knockoff. Batsy Knockoff. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> Is it the fact that I have a Batman mom? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. <laughs> and you are. All right. Uh, I go by Hooky Bulovich online. Uh, I I have a YouTube. I don't. I post nothing there. I have a Twitter at Hooky Bulovich. I retweet garbage. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> Friend me on Discord too. Uh, yeah, at Hooky Bulovich. Uh, I don't remember my tag. Yeah. Oh, GB Stinky. Stop! Stop playing Star GB stinky. Wars! GB it's stinky. Brick Fair! It's Brick Fair and you're playing Star Wars! Stevie Inky, Stevie Inky. What are you saying? Stevie Inky. Idiot! Stevie Stevie. Ah. Guys, this is Owen Martin. <laughs> Karaganuva. And this is. Summoner. Website and YouTube channel uh, called Crosswired Geeks. Uh, we're, we're hosting a lot of different types of stuff there. Uh, we're start doing some let's plays. Uh, I'm doing a series of video essays called Deconstructing Bionicle, taking a closer look at Bionicle's story. Kind of good. <laughs> at least according to this guy. Uh, and we'll be doing other stuff in the future like build videos and other stuff like that. Uh, the website also is the new home of Biological Chronicle, the complete collection of the whole Bionicle story. a lot of masks. Thank you. If this one here is made of the little bricks that are this big right here, what we're doing is we're making them, not we, what you're doing is you're making them four times larger, so it's four times long. Oh, no, look at the platform. Jordan, look who it is. Right over here. It's right Mr. Hinkle. What is he Virginia doing? Virginia is the lovers of the uh, George. What is, uh, what is Kevin Hinkle a member of? He's a member of the Fox Gang. You can join Fox Gang now. All I have to do is put Illinois, hashtag no, Fox here. Gang in the... In the... Rhode Island, little itty bitty stick. Comments. No, no. What is this? Is this L.J. Johnson? Or is that L.J. Johnson? I don't know. Uh, that's Kevin Hinkle's phone. Wow, look at this guy. He's taking a picture. It's Kevin Hinkle's phone. Taking a picture for Kevin Hinkle. It belongs to Kevin Hinkle. What are you looking at? You died. Hey, it's Pablo. He's so adorable. Ah, look at that cute little boy. <laughs> 
thought it was funny. Connor just gave me the camera, and I'm walking around filming things like the big spinny boy. Look at it. Ooh. Connor, what's happening? Everything's being taken down. It's over. It's over? This brick fair is done. It's only been a day. See these? Oh! Knifed. Oh! I knifed Brick Fair, Virginia. Oh! Ah! Next up is a ski boat worth $80 billion. Goes to Chris Kabinsky. Chris Kabinsky. Come on down. Tell us who you are and where we can find you. My name is Mitch Henry. I'm on Twitter and I'm on Instagram and pretty much any other uh, Bionicle social media. Um, check out BioCup 2019. The BioCup was awesome. <laughs> I'm Construction Diva and you can follow me on Flickr at Construction Diva and Instagram at Construction Diva. Wait, what were you about to say? What? what? What were you about to Unfollow say? Unfollow Alex Park Designs on Instagram. Oh no! There can only be one Alex. <laughs> I was gonna say when that, when you said Alex when you introduced yourself as Alex at first, I was just like, That's you're not Alex, Alex Park, right? But I didn't see any of his, any of his mocks there, so yeah. All right. Uh, follow me at uh, Corn Builder on Flickr, Instagram, and uh, have a fantabulous corny time. <laughs> yeah, corn. <laughs> All right. Who's next? Yeah. Uh, follow me at uh, Toa Era on Flickr. Uh, I actually start posting stuff now. Yay. <laughs> follow me at Steve the Squid on Flickr. You're Steve the Squid? I'm Steve the Squid. Oh, dude, I'd never even talk to you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you. <laughs> Thank you, man. You can follow me on Socketball on Flickr and Socketball Masks on Instagram. This stuff is awesome. Yeah, it's been a great trip here. Yes. Enjoy being here. Yes. All right, nice to meet you once again. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Thank you, thank you. Hey, everyone, this is Mod Alt Mask uh, coming at you at Brick Fair. Uh, we had a great time this year, uh, and we're going to have a great time next year. All right. Brick Fair is over. We have everything packed away. All my mocks are in there, all my clothes and pretty much all my loot is in there. I got my carry-on bag, got my sunglasses and my chapstick, got my shoes, got my feet. Brick fair is over. We're leaving in 15 minutes. I get on the shuttle, they get back on the plane. And I'm sick. <laughs> Sound like you're reading a book. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't vlog too much, but that was really crazy. It was really fun. We're gonna try and be back next year. So don't be sad. You sound like you're crying. I am crying, George. <laughs> I'm crying. I'm <laughs> crying. Ah. <sighs> But we had a lot of fun. Stop it. And it's time to go home Stop. now. It's time to go home now. <laughs>
Hoffman here once again. Uh, it's been almost a month, if not exactly a month, since Brick Fair ended, and I'm just now finally getting to editing this vlog. Without further ado, we need to go over the loot from Brick Fair. So, let's take a look. So, pretty much from here to here is all the all the goodies I brought home from Brick Fair. So starting with the Lego sets, we've got a, uh, a Lego Tron set. I got that from the Lego store trip. Uh, I also got the last Bionicle 2016 set I needed for my collection, Akimu the Mask Maker. Also, I finally got myself a Takanuva from 03, and I've never had that set before. Same with Nadiki here. He's missing a claw, but uh, that's that's all right, it's a really common piece. I still needed Biddle as well from the Mystica, and I found one in the canister, so I went ahead and snatched that. Uh, that Darth Maul's from Walmart, that doesn't count. Uh, I also got Metis, and yeah, that's pretty much all the Lego sets I got. These two guys uh, are not Lego sets. This here is Scrawl, Noxus, and uh, Kenpaku. And uh, the reason I've got them on display here is because they they're using some custom painted pieces from Modalt Masks. So, I finally got my custom Kakama commissioned for Kanpaku. And he looks amazing now with that. I also had him paint this uh, 3D printed Kanohi Alissi, which I got from uh, King K. He uh, was nice enough to go around and give away a bunch of 3D printed masks for free. So I got that, as well as this uh, Killer Queen uh, Picari that he designed. So, look forward to seeing a uh, Karsani mock some point in the future. Um, as well as that, I went ahead and bought some more 3D printed masks from Red Star Games. One of which I may be using on Tobe Duck. This one, right here, in the future. I just got it take a look at how it looks on him. Um, some more stuff I got from Brick Fair. I got some of these rare masks, so I went ahead and bought this, and this uh, glitter Evoki came with, obviously, came with Takanuva. And then right here in the middle is a 3D printed green, not, is a misprinted, not 3D printed. This is a misprint Kanohi Ruru. That was a gift from Jameson, also known as Brappy Hour. Uh, he's one of our guides to Brick Fair for both North Carolina and uh, and the Virginia one. So that was awfully nice of him to give me that. I really appreciate that, man, if you're watching. Um, also, I participated in the Impaired Build, which we got these two Lego sets here. This uh, Lego City, like, Farmers, um, whatever the heck this is called, a Combine, I think. And then I also got this... Uh, Portal 2 dimension set. Obviously, I don't have Lego dimensions, so this is just a uh, this is just a cool set for the minifigures and the, the stuff as well. Uh, Chocolate Frogs, otherwise known as Ben, our other guide for Brick Fair, gave me this little spaceship he he built. So that's uh, very nice of him as well. Thank you, man, if you're watching. Um, as well as that, we've got some Brick Fair merch uh, from the Impaired Build. I won this Brick Fair shot glass, so that's nice. And uh, got a couple of mugs. Got a pick a brick cup from the Lego store while we were out there. Just a whole bunch of nice pieces, including some new colors. And speaking of new colors, uh, Brick Fair's bingo tiles uh, this year are this new coral pink color. So that's that's well, that's pretty cool as well. Uh, got a free, got a uh, custom printed Pac-Man tile. That was a gift from Jordan. Thank you, man. Um, as well as these uh, cool little flower pieces. Picked up a uh, a teal Unikitty, as well as some some more Lego Star Wars minifigures. Uh, and I went ahead and picked up the first six comics in the Bionicle comic series. These were. Uh, these were the only comics that came out before I started uh, collecting them or getting LEGO Magazine at all. So I started getting LEGO Magazine all the way back in, I think it was 02, I got the uh, the What Lurks Below comic. That was my first Bionicle comic. So that's 
that's most of my collection complete, if not all of it. Uh, and I got a whole bunch of this part here from one of the games we played. It was called the Seed Part Showdown, and this was the seed part. So uh, at the end of the game, you got to keep as many of the seed parts as you wanted. Uh, so I, I just took home a whole bunch of them. Um, there's the instructions and the stickers for all the Lego sets I bought. And then over here is our uh, fancy schmancy uh, signed BioCraft poster. I had to grab one of those while I was there. Very nice. There's the Brick Fair uh, tote bag this year. Here's my other one from, uh, from North Carolina. Still sitting out and don't know what to do with it yet. And then lastly, the most important stuff, all these pieces. So this time I actually signed up for some parts drafts, and uh, these are two, these were only two drafts, so the parts in these two bags are the parts from the construction draft, and this is the parts from the Technic draft, so, uh, as well as some extra pieces from my badge in there. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I may have paid Jordan to uh, take a place in the, uh, the construction draft so I could get the parts twice so that's why I have those and as well as that I actually ended up being able to buy two spots in the Technic draft as well so I got a whole bunch of nice Technic pieces all at once which is awesome the very useful pieces oh yeah so yeah guys that is it I hope you enjoyed this nearly hour-long video um, I wouldn't blame you if you watched it at two times speed or skipped mostly through it but, you know, that's how it goes. Uh, hopefully I'll see you guys again in a couple of days for a new how to build. And if not, probably a week. And, uh, yeah, all the uh, people I met at Brick Fair, it was a pleasure meeting you all. And I hope to see you again next year. See you later.